Kendall Jenner opens up about the guilt of her 19-year anxiety struggle, we're all s. Kendall Jenner is being open about how her anxiety has damaged her moral compass. In an exclusive clip from Thursday's episode of The Kardashians, the 27-year-old supermodel opens up about her history with anxiety and confesses she wasn't able to pinpoint the feeling in her chest until much later in life. I think I was about 8 years old, from what I remember, she says to the cameras. But I thought there was something wrong with me physically. I forced my mother take me to a heart doctor, a lung doctor, a brain doctor, and all these other people because I suspected something was wrong with me. Jenner recalls that people didn't really talk about anxiety the way they do now, and that I never knew that that's what that was until later in life being like, oh, that's what that was that whole time. And I had no idea. The scene transitions to Jenner discussing her concerns with Scott Disick, who adds that people are often quick to condemn her based on her appearance, work, and financial standing. Everybody's got a problem, he says, adding, yeah, I think that's the common misconception. It's as if we're all people and have feelings. I have definitely struggled with a little bit of guilt for even feeling anxious or ill because I have so many blessings and I'm such a lucky person. But we all have s, to some extent, she admits in an interview. So I think just a little more compassion would be nice. This isn't the first time Jenner has discussed her anxiousness. Jenner discussed her early experiences with the condition in an interview with psychologist Dr. Ramani Dervasila for Vogue's Open Minded series in May 2021. I remember being really young, I'd say 8, 9, 10 and having shortness of breath and going to my mom and telling her that, she said. The 818 creator admitted that as her celebrity grew, her mental health suffered. I think being overworked and being in the situation that I'm in now is kind of what set it out of control in a way, she told me. There have been times when I feel like I need to be rushed to the hospital because I believe my heart is failing, I can't breathe, and I need someone to help me. Sometimes I think I'm going to die. I'll never sit here and say I'm unlucky. I am aware that I lead a very privileged and fantastic life. I'm a very blessed girl, she stated before adding, but at the end of the day, I'm still a human being.